These are my chickens. And these two are buff coaching. Just greasing up the hedge here. I wonder whose chickens they are. I, this is the daughter's chickens and I'm the one doing the work. These are my chickens. So these are my chickens and this one here is Strawberry, she's the biggest of our rescue hens, these had the rescue. This one is Sunshine, I have names for all of them, this one's Maple, this here is Apple and um, Red Wings, Silky and Little Woo Woo who's the smallest and the youngest. And this here is Daisy and she's laying in it. So let's see how many eggs we got here. Anyway, that's how many we got today. So one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten from these girls. And they do make quite a loud sound actually. chickens so these two are aracana they're both females and they lay blue eggs i think they're about 23 weeks old now maybe a bit more we got them as 12 weeks old and these two are buff coaching so this one's sooty she's our black aracana This is Snow, she's a white aracana. This one here is May, she's the biggest of the two buff coaches. And this one here is Pearl, she's the slightly smaller one. And um, we love them. Oh. 
They're actually pretty heavy. Um, actually, none of these two girls are laying. Only one of those two, and we don't know who. But these two lay blue eggs. So, you got a blue egg today. I'll show you it in a minute. So, this one here has been laid by either City or Snow, or one of our blue Araucanas. And it's kind of greenish. And it's not off. It's just laid today. It's kind of cold. But the difference is these shell is this shell is much harder and obviously it's a coloured egg layer, but the shell is much harder. But it's nothing different in the actual egg colour. <laughs> Just greasing up the hedge you here. Finished with it obviously because now, as I said earlier, it's well in one of my other videos, it's now the first of past the first of March, I don't know what it is today, third, second, third or something. So I'm just uh, greasing up all the head and everything. Hi guys, I'm behind the camera taking these uh, cables off. I don't think you probably hear what I was saying out there because of the too far away from the camera. The tractor's obviously run, so it's just a bit to take it off. But yeah, this uh, hey, is not a five minute thing to put on or take off. To put on is even worse than taking off. I should be done probably in about, about five minutes. Like the control box, the control box here now, put that back in the engine. Right, all that remains to take off is this uh, heat unit guard. I'm going to grease that up in a minute. It's far easier to grease the PO up when it's off the tractor than when it's on. I'll just start the tractor up and drive it forward. I'm going to try and do them one day. It's going to be a bit of a challenge to see because I've got. Good evening. The darkness beat me, but. 